Hello LiveWires, Heather Boyd Wire here. Today I had a special request from Sona Moni to make a BTS necklace. What you're going to need for this project is 20 gauge wire. I have some chain, jump rings, split ring, a lobster clasp and my tools. So I have about a 10 to 12 inch piece of wire and I'm just going to start at the top. I will link up a playlist of letter tutorials below if you want to do other letters and we're going to bring this one around and then I'm going to get my larger pliers and bring this one around here and then I'm going to hold that bring this one around that wire to the front and again the round plier bring this one actually around to the back curve it out a little bit so there's your B and then I need to finish this end so I'm just going to take this bring that one around and clip it pinch it in so it's not sharp and from there I'm just going to bend this around to the back so it's just behind there and then I'll just bring this one straight up to form the T and then at this right height here we're just going to bend this one across and you could do a straight line or you can make it more curved. So if we want to curve it, we're going to bring it down here, bend that one to the front and then just bend it around. And if you want it even more fancy, just bend it up. So it does a little bit of a curve. Just makes it a little more fancy. And then we're going to take this end, bend it to the back. So we're going to push it in, hold it, curve it to follow that line and then we'll take this one and bend it straight back behind there. So there we have the B and the T and then we're just going to bend this one across. Where we want the S to start we'll just bend it up a little bit and then not too high we're going to take this end and bend it to the front. So this is how it looks and then we'll get our round pliers bend this around bring it around and then the top part can be a little bit smaller. Just bend it straight out like that and we're going to make a loop. So we're just going to mimic the loop that we had on the side there. So we bring that one around, make a little bit of a loop, clip that one, pinch it. So now we're going to take our chain Put those two ends together and we'll cut it at the halfway point. Open up a jump ring, stick it on one of the links and put it through the B. Close it up, take the other jump ring, put it through the S and through the other chain and close it up. And then we'll take the other end, put a jump ring and a split ring or another kind of clasp and this side we'll put another jump ring and a lobster clasp. Put that on. I use the 12 millimeter lobster clasp. You're going to close it up and there you have your super sweet and simple BTS necklace. So thanks so much for watching the video. Give it a big thumbs up if you liked it. Be sure to subscribe to my channel for lots more wire art and jewelry making videos. Hit the notification bell to be notified when I go live and when I post new videos. And if you'd like to share photos of your wire art and jewelry, be sure to join the Wire Makers Club on Facebook. And if you'd like to check out our work on Etsy, my husband and I specialize in custom wedding cake toppers and funky jewelry. I also have a mailing list so if you'd like to submit your email I will send you my free Wire Art Essentials ebook. So thanks again for watching and we'll see you the next time.